good afternoon, good morning. We're so glad you're here. We daily vlogs. So if you like this video, come back tomorrow. You guys know we thrive in hectic environments, which is why we go to Disney World all the time. So why not bring some of our nephews downtown to a very hectic Macy's on State Street? <laughs> There's Angela. <laughs> days before Christmas. They are going to write letters to Santa. A letter? Alrighty, we are headed to breakfast at the Pittsfield Cafe. What do they have? Like breakfasty food, like eggs and toast and probably pancakes and hash browns. Are you hungry? Yeah. I can't wait to eat my food. You gotta say it. <laughs> my food. <laughs> Jump up. Okay. Look at that. <laughs> My Hardcore. Right. Right. Okay. <laughs> Look at the ceiling. So this cafe has seating like in the lobby and then inside. Their menu is so big and good and they offer lunch or they offer their full menu even this early they have a ton of options i think i'm gonna get the greek skillet just with no meat or cheese just lots of veggies a ton of different lunch and dinner Ooh, hot dogs no nope. all right we're gonna go show jackson the inside of pittsburgh but this is a cute little diner our food is here what'd you say Ketchup. Okay, oh, on. ketchup. <laughs> I got you. Got eggs. Dom got blueberry Belgian waffle. Here is my skillet. I did double veggies instead of eggs. And then they have this Louisiana hot sauce I put on it. Are you happy? And she got a steak Santa Fe burrito. Jackson, what did you get? He's eating his bacon right now. Oh, okay. Pancakes. Chocolate pancakes, bacon. Leave that for Nicholas, maybe. And some sausage, I think, over there, too. Yeah. And Dom literally put a pool of syrup on his Belgian waffles. I also got pico de gallo if you want. Some. I don't want it. I'm just going to hot sauce it up and share it with Dom. All right, Dom, I'm going to cover the Belgian waffles. You took about 90 seconds to eat them all. Your pan pancakes were a little too sweet, so you traded with mom? So I'm gonna show you before we leave, because we packed up, I ran to the bathroom. And this building is so old, it's got, there's one of these setups where there's all these old storefronts in the basement. So this building itself is well over hundred years old, but look at these cool, this we're in the basement and there's like literal storefronts for different businesses. Now that none of these are open, but it's just so cool. I wish that they would be open. If we ever move back to Chicago and become a business person, I would love to buy one of these as a storefront. It's hard because you don't get foot traffic, but the thing is you make a name for yourself and the business comes to you. All old original limestone in the buildings. Look, look at those details. I think it's the Pittsfield, is this building? Yeah, the Pittsfield building and it's well over hundred years old. I love it. And the Pittsfield Cafe is just a hidden gem, decent price, great service. Gave me and Angela to go cups of coffee just because we were talking about it. But I mean, come on. All right, Dominic and Jackson request the bean, so we're going to the bean. Whoa. Probably, what would you say, like upper 40s right now? Yeah, Low 50s? Not, close to 50s? Yeah, it's so nice. There's like I no clouds. Yeah, it's really, really nice. We're gonna walk now over from Millennium Park to Maggie Daly Park and um, go over there because we've never taken that walk before. 
Why don't they both went down together? Let's see if we can go on these ones and race. You gonna go to, are you gonna go down the slide, Nicholas? First part of the day over. Yes. To go back to Eve and bring her outside and see with her, play with her for like maybe five or ten minutes. Transfer the vlog to Sarah's phone. Ooh, it's windy. I'm gonna shave and do my hair. Get to grab our gifts yeah. for the big Sarah's mom's side of the family's big Christmas party, which is tonight. Yeah, double cousins. And we gotta drive. I feel, I feel like we really haven't stopped since driving, and so. I'm excited. Like the party is obviously like we're gonna be doing stuff, visiting and things. But like I'm gonna sit on their couch yeah. and like breathe for a second. <laughs> um, but it's good. And I feel like after today we have like our days are less jam packed. Um, kind of. Kind of not. Kind of. Kind of not. Just in different ways. Well, there's not jam packed. We still have stuff every single day. Right. All day. Like we yeah. know what we're doing all day, yeah. every day. We're at the family party, look at all the gifts. Our cousin made special vegan sauce for us, Thank for the Ronies. Could you give me? No, that's good. That's good. Yeah, I think my mom made that. I was doing like a nice montage of that, and here comes Grant. <laughs> Do white elephant i got my card here this dictates my turn on picking what gift i want all right so far i got the sharpie 30 count but since i'm the first i also get the steel last so if this gets stolen i get the very last steal i have the best card in the group but this is a pretty sweet gift to grab all right halfway through my sharpies got stolen and i got this instead so it looks like i'm gonna be stealing at the end of this game i will go home with the sharpies if nothing else shows up my last item got stolen so i took one for the team so we stole that from our sweet little cousin ruin his christmas no he's not little he is very sweet connor sarah wanted the blanket so i stole from him he was like I gave him a precious moments figuring. I believe several hours later, we are back at our Airbnb home with our Everson. She's sleepy and so are we. Yes. We realized that uh, contrary to typical family parties, since we don't have our typical vlogging camera, we're using our cell phone. I don't think any of the kids took any of our cell phones no, at the party. No, it was simple and we kind of just soaked in our 
Mm -hmm. Get our time. I got some good um, present time stuff. But I think we're going to go to sleep now. We got to figure out our plan for tomorrow because I have to work, but we have to do things too before the two days that the offices are closed on Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. So we're going to say. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. My contact just like literally did a backflip out of my eyeball. <laughs> good night. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.